This is Luke with Tailgate and Challenge. We love coolers, and we love coolers that have technology built into them. So today we're checking out the two coolers that are mass-produced that have a stereo system built into them. On the left, you can see the white Alpine Ice stereo cooler, and on the right, the Sonpex Coolmax cooler. Let's take a look at both of these individually. First off, you have the kind of clean, classic design of the Alpine Ice cooler. It's a Grizzly cooler. It has 90 watts by two power built in. It's a Bluetooth enabled device where you can plug it all in. It does not have an internal battery. So as you can see over here, we have a Goal Zero that's helping to power everything right now. It also has a car plug. We can plug into your cigarette lighter as well if you wanted to charge that up. Let's take a look inside. See the space, 56 quarts. Trusted Grizzly brand cooler, Alpine logo on there. Got the bear hooks on it as well. And then we can also listen. Let's see how it sounds. And I'm going to play something through another phone over here so we can listen to some of the beats on here. So it has an awesome bass, very crisp highs on it as well too. Uh, it has no FM radio or hookups for um, like a microphone or anything like that. Um, but great cooler, great sound. Let's go over here and take a look at the Sonpex cooler. So the Sonpex cooler is a little bit smaller cooler. You can see it has some cup holders on top, a little storage facility on there as well. We put some things in there. Take this off and take a look inside. There's the storage compartment in there. You can see the drain plug at the bottom. And here, we'll put this up. You can reach in. So it's waterproof as well. This has a remote control with it. There's a control panel. Crank up the music a little bit. Three months. While Home Pest Plus Germ Killer handles the bugs inside your home. On radio, Lows right? and this is on radio right now. Let's see if we can find something else that's playing. TNT Internet Service. There's something for you. Más variedad, más trancazos, más norteña. Solo en la grande 107.5. So it's got some good sound on there as well, too. I would say it's not quite as crisp and clear as the Alpine. But it does have some hookups down here that are kind of cool as well, too. You can charge it, you can hook up USB, you can hook up your power source, and then you can hook up a microphone um, or like a guitar or something like that as well, too. So, again, both of these coolers are awesome in their own right. Which one's best for you? It depends. The Sonpex on the right-hand side is a little bit less expensive at around... Three to three fifty, um, about three hundred fifty dollars for that one, and then the Alpine is roughly right now about fifteen hundred. Um, so again, the Alpine packs some better sound, more space. Uh, Sonpex has a few additional features on there as well too. Uh, music is still good, but not quite as crisp as the Alpine name. So again, they're great coolers, great sound. Which one's best for you? Only you can decide. This is Luke with Tailgate and Challenge. Get out there and have a great tailgate.